All right, so I just logged into one of my accounts and uh, as you can see, I have this notification, but it is written in, I don't know if this is Chinese or some other Asian language, but I don't understand it. But you can see my previous notifications are always in English. So yeah, in this video, I want to show you guys how to translate text in any language you want. And the way to do this is by using Google Translate. It's a free app that you can use to translate text from one language to another. Sorry, my voice is a bit messed up because I, I just had a fever. All right, so normally you can just long press on the text and copy it, but I feel like that's too much work. So the best thing to do is to just take a screenshot. So I'm going to do that right now. For most devices, you can press the power button as well as the volume down button at the same time, and it's going to take a screenshot. But for me, I'm just going to long press the home button because I set it to take a screenshot that way. So I'll tap this and just, you know, clean up the screenshot so we can just focus on the text alone. Okay, so this is the text I want to translate. So I'll just tap here to save it. Next, I'll open this app. This is the Google Translate app. If you don't have it, I'll leave a link to it in the description for Android devices. I don't know about iOS devices, so I'll just recommend going to the App Store and then doing a search for Translate or Google Translate and you should see the app. It should have the same logo. So when you get the app, just install it to your device and open it all right so after opening the app you can see over here it has this option for you to paste text that you copied i'm not going to do that i want the app to read the text from the screenshot that i took so i have to tap here you can also do the same and uh, right now it is showing my desk everywhere is a bit dark so over here you see this thumbnail so you just tap it and it's going to show you the screenshots you have on your phone if you can't find the picture over here you tap here and it's going to show you different folders that your phone has where you can find pictures. So maybe you downloaded the picture or maybe you took a picture of the picture that came out weird. But maybe you have a picture that you took that has like text in another language. You can tap the camera icon or the camera option to view pictures that are in your phone's camera roll. So for me, I'm just going to tap screenshots. And next, I'm going to select this. So as you can see, it is reading the text. So over here, you can see it is showing two languages. It is saying from English to Spanish. Now we know for sure that this is not English. So we'll tap here and then we'll select detect language. So now it is saying Chinese, which was the first thing I thought. And uh, it is translating to Spanish, but I don't understand Spanish that much. I only know like four or five words. So I'll tap here and then I'll select English. If you don't see English over here, you just scroll through this list and you should find English. So this is English, I'll tap here. And now you can see it has been translated. The picture has been translated from Chinese to English. If you want to see the original language, you can tap here and then you tap this. So it's going to show you the original picture. You can see it says show original text. So if I tap here, can see the the language in English and uh, over reading this right now I don't even understand what I'm reading but I'll read it later on I know I'm just focused on making this video but if the picture was like long you can actually scroll it's just that the picture is short you can scroll through I've I've tried this in the past and it worked well so yeah that is how you translate images in another language if you want to choose a different language you can just Choose a language that you're interested in and it should translate it. You can see it has been translated to, I think this is Czech. Anyways, so that's how you do it. If you found the video helpful, please give it a like and subscribe for more videos like this. If you have questions, you can leave them in the comments and I'll try to respond as soon as I can. Thank you for watching and I'll be seeing you in the next video. Take care and bye-bye.